Hi Taurus, it's Elle here to do uh, a quick reading for you. This will cover career and finance, love and romance. Um, let's get into it. Thank you, God, for blessing Taurus with a clear, concise message from you. Um, all links are below if you need to get in contact with me, Taurus. Let's start with love and romance. Love and romance. All right, so what's going on for Taurus in terms of love? All right, the devil. Ooh. All right, so you could be having some fun times, you know. Um, you could be in a third party situation. You could be in a taboo situation, something that is um, maybe unconventional, of, of course, taboo here. Um, whatever that may mean for you, this could be third party. This could be extramarital affair. This could just be sex, drugs, and rock and roll. What is this about? Justice card. Um, it's funny that both of these cards talk about choices, the right choice, the right decision, right choice and right decision. You need to choose what's right and you need to decide to cut something or someone out, whatever this may be. Um, this could even be a lifestyle way of thinking. Don't allow yourself to be easily deceived by. This could also be a, a friend group. Yeah, six of cups. This could be someone who you thought was or is a soulmate thought that you were having really good times with this person. Maybe you were very fond of them. Um, this could be a friend. This could be a lover. This could be someone that you grew up with. You know, you've been with them for a very long time, maybe now into adulthood. Maybe you, you kind of were teenager, lo teenage love. I don't know. This is somebody you grew up with and um, maybe you have children now. Somebody is sticking around for the children. Yeah, Knight of Pentacles. It, the relationship has become a little bit mundane, boring, um, kind of, uh, you know, um, systematic. You already know what's happening. It's doomed. There's someone is dooming the relationship because you guys have been together for so long. It could be you, could be the other person. Nine of Cups. Yeah, somebody is just wanting some, some fresh blood pumped into the relationship, some fun, some luxury, some good sex, some good food, some trip, something here. Um, somebody is also like du duality. Like I like to be a family woman, family man, but then I also like to go and do whatever it is I do away from the family. The seven of pentacles. Um, someone is wondering if something is going to change. Is it going to get better? Is it, is, you know, does it get better? Uh, with the seven of pentacles, somebody wants harvest. Somebody wants to reap the, the the goodness the good times the three of pentacles yeah somebody wants like longevity maybe a long-term relationship somebody's been in some boyfriend girlfriend side chick side dude whatever type of capacity for a very long time somebody could be pregnant all right someone doesn't know who they're pregnant by or it's up to three different people um yeah knight of cups here looks like somebody could be nearing maybe giving birth seven of cups with the emperor, somebody's kind of got their feet kicked up. They're laid out. They're having a good time. Um, living the lap of luxury. Uh, maybe overindulging, overeating, over drinking, doing something over, over. Um, somebody has a lot of money. Uh, maybe they have a, a discretionary money and they do whatever they want to do with it. They buy with their, whatever, they go wherever, they eat whatever. This could be like, this is like the pamper princess, the pamper woman, maybe because it's like somebody's given to this. Like, I don't know if this woman has children and the baby's fathers are giving money here. The uh, Knight of Swords and the Six of Wands here. Somebody is determined to persuade someone to be a part of maybe some cheating scandal. Somebody is trying to persuade somebody to be loose or lax with their morals, their principles to be. Yeah. Someone is trying to persuade them that this is OK. Take part in it. You know, it's, it's OK to do so. It's OK that I have another person. It's OK that um, I'm giving to two different parties. I'm sharing myself. I'm spreading myself thin. The Queen of Pentacles and the King of Wands here. It seems as if two people are not on the same wavelength here with the Queen of Pentacles and the King of Wands. Somebody is um, desiring the Queen of, of Pentacles. Uh, she's stable. She's independent. 
She cares about her body. She cares about herself. Uh, she can live the lap of luxury because she's done a lot of work to do so. Um, the King of Wands is just desiring her. Like he just wants her. He just wants to possess her. He wants access to her. Um, so this is like two people not on the same page. Uh, yeah, Five of Swords. They're kind of enemy to one another, contrary to what each other want. Yeah. Um, so it's like you're dealing with somebody who, it's a lot of different situations in here. Somebody could be married, couple, they go do their own thing, but they also like being a married man or a married woman. There's also like the pampered princess. Somebody's got money or resources coming in from different ways, uh, different money. They don't have to do anything for money. They don't have to work. Um, and then we have somebody trying to persuade maybe, um, a single woman to be a part of. Um, some third party situation here. Let's see what career and finance offers you, uh, Taurus. Car career and finance for Taurus. Uh, the Ace of Swords. So you're seeing clearly now, you're seeing the truth of the matter in terms of other people's money, uh, in terms of a large sum of money, in terms of luxury, in terms of um, maybe changing careers for some of you. Um, you want somebody to pay for pay you pay you for your time you might get paid for your time yeah um pay you for your time you're being patient with them but they need to give you some money or you're closing up shop you don't want to deal with them uh the two of wands some of you are going to do you're doing two different things to earn income looks like one is going to dominate the other some of you this could be like a business Starting a business, um, trying to get it out there, trying to get traction to your business. It looks like there could be some unexpected help. Some, um, yeah. So this is you maybe operating in your masculine if you are feminine, because you're trying to institute something. So that means you're trying to bring something into fruition, into realness, into the 3D world. So it's like you're trying to um, maybe start something. Something to have to do with maybe the esoteric, the the occult, crystals, business, and maybe your dreams. You're trying to bring something into fruition. It looks like you could see a level of success here and money could start to come in. Uh, maybe even beginner's luck is what I'm hearing. There could be promotion or somebody's helping promote you or promote this or put something out there. Something about masculine energy. I don't know. It's this is this is masculine energy panel and talking. So I don't know if you do something on a panel um, with masculine energy, other men or men. I don't know. Anyhow, you got good news coming in about you know promoting yourself or self promotion or money or a large sum of money coming to you. The three of Wands. It, yeah, it's going to allow you to expand or increase put things together, uh, maybe even take a break and kind of let think the, the dust settle behind, maybe leaving something behind or changing something, shifting something. The two of swords and the queen of swords here. Um, you may have cut somebody off or they cut you off or you're just not looking at it. You're not going to be fo focused on this or you're not. Yeah. You're not going to be focused on this for whatever reason. Um, you leaving something behind. Yeah, it's like you're not taking this with you into maybe the new year, into the new you. You're done. You're done with something or you're done with somebody or they're done with you. Someone is trying to act like they don't see that there's another person also, that there's another energy, that maybe somebody has another affair that they're keeping up. Somebody is just really trying to cooperate, compromise it's just it's like I don't feel like arguing about it I don't want to be I don't really want to deal with this support I was getting that too like somebody had get support child support or, or lots of support or supporters or people pay you for your time or your energy anyway you got support here um, and if you think that you don't do know that you do some people will support you or you're getting supporters in terms of your business. So it looks good for you, Taurus. This is what I have for you. If it resonates, go over to the website book there. Ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. 
You can also donate to the channel by clicking the Buy Ella Coffee link. Catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Go over to the website, learn the tarot with me. Classes are linked below. Thank you. Many blessings to you. Take care.